stupid. Every time I try to come up with an idea, it just backfires. What else can I possibly do? Ugh. Stupid. Servant. Did you bring anyone else that can help me? You already know, you dummy. Problems with the castle. <sighs> Nobody. Of course you didn't. Oh yeah, the woman in the dungeon. Uh, the dungeon, um... I guess you can... I'm just extremely tired right now. I ain't got time for this. Take her out. I gotta talk to her anyways. I can't even speak right. Ugh, this makes me angry. Yeah, you. Come up here. <sighs> Don't look at me like that. I'm not going to hurt you unless you... Do something for me. I give you food, shelter, everything else. And I know you have a reason to be scared of me. But the point is, you're mine. There's nothing you can do about it. I'm the king, and you can't leave. You'll never leave. So, if you can be my servant for the rest of your life, or I guess you can be my queen. I really, really don't want a queen, though. I'm not a simp. That's why. Plus, I don't want a woman trying to take over this castle, too. This is my castle. No one else's. Are you going to make the decision? Which decision are you making? I do not have all day. Okay. Just step on your freaking head. Yeah, you like that, don't you? That's what you be. That's where you need to be. On the ground. Isn't it? Isn't it fun? You like this, don't you? Maybe if I just feel on your butt. Did you just try to hit me? Yeah, you better say you're sorry. That's what I thought. Don't you ever do that again. I won't let you do it next time. Okay, how about this? I'll give you an hour to think about it. Once the hour is up, you better know what you going to do, or else I'll choose it for you. You already know what I'm going to choose. So, goodbye. I said screw off. Oh, freaking stupid woman. Oh, I freaking hate her. But at the same time, I love her. 
oh, I don't know what to do anymore. Servant, should I just love her instead of being mean to her like that? Dumbass, I just said a question. Ugh. You servants are so stupid. Just go away. An hour's almost up. She should be almost done. Wait, what? Oh no, you don't! Come here! You tried to escape? I try to love you. You ungrateful little bitch. Oh, that's sorry. It's not going to work on me anymore. Because guess what? I'm going to choose for you now. I'll let you be my queen. But you're going to have to do everything I say and tell you to do. For the rest of your miserable life. I'm the king. I can do that. And you're just going to be the most miserable queen in my kingdom. You can't do shit about it. You understand? So shut up. I said shut up. Stop screaming for help. Help is not going to help you. No one's going to help you. Nobody can. You understand me? I will burn you to a crisp if you try to call for help again. Shh, don't you even dare. Don't try it. That's it. Calm down. That's it. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Cry. Cry, cry. That's what you are. Just a miserable crybaby that belongs to me. <laughs> That's what you are, lady. <laughs> you can't do nothing about it. <laughs> Get up. I don't want to see you on the ground. I try loving you, but at the same time, I just hate you. <sighs> I should have killed you right here. But I made my decision. But if you try to escape again, I will kill you next time. Just remember that thought. When Barco, the king, King Barco, I like you saying that. I want to do something to you, I want to do something to you. So you better have your ears open for when I call you. Especially at night, if you know what I mean. And I'm going to explain that. You already know what it is. Anyways. The servants are going to get you dressed. To get whatever clothes on you want, but you better be down here by my throne tonight. Because we get a lot to discuss. You understand me? Good. Now go before I change my mind. <laughs>